What's up guys, Nose Freak here, and um, I'm doing a quick video here to uh, show you guys a new member to my game collection family, I guess I could say. It's a new system and three new games. Um, and yeah, so this is probably, besides you know, Super Nintendo, this is the best system of the 90s, I guess. Well, in my opinion, I used to have one. Uh, <clears throat> I used to play it a lot, but then it broke. We even had a whole giant box of games for it and stuff, with like Beavis and Butthead and all those good games. And that's kind of the way it was, but... Anyway, here it is. Sega Genesis Model 1. And one controller. Um, yeah, it's a Model 1, which is pretty cool. Uh, my uncle came by today, he stopped by, and he's like, oh yeah, I got something for you here. It's in my car, so he walked over and said, like, yeah, I know you told me that you were looking for some old games, and I found this in my basement, so here you go. It's like a, it's like, yes. Like, thank you. Um, <clears throat> see, so yeah, it gave me the Genesis, the uh, RF switch cable thing, and a power adapter. But the power adapter he gave me was a little, like, broken here or something. That's why it has tape on it. Uh, but it still it still had the power going through it and stuff, but I figured uh, I, Oh, I knew that one cable that you guys probably saw if you watched my NES unboxing video for this NES right here um, That the guy who sold me the NES For some reason he gave me a Genesis power adapter, so I was like hell yeah I could use that one cause it's not broken so I found a use for it and it works uh, Comes on black screen yay but, anyway, um, <clears throat> yes, yeah, alright, so I'm going to show you guys these three games I've got here, and they are all in their box, which is awesome, and they all have manuals too, so I'm super happy about that. Alright, so the first game here, and it's probably the least, or like the not, you know, best one that's in here, it's really not that good, I heard, but that's PGA Tour Golf. Um... PGA Tour, yeah. Here. And the carts are in all, they're all in great condition though, because he only had it for, he only played it for like a year or something, and he just didn't, he didn't play it anymore. Um, but yeah, the manual has even got the registration card from EA underneath it here. Just, uh, get this manual. Oops, sorry. Hang on. There it is. Registration card. So, there's that. Oh, we we'll got one to four players. Um, I only see two slots here, so, yeah, I don't know, because I, I haven't had a Genesis since, like, 1999 or something like that, because that's when it broke, and I didn't start collecting, so I don't know too much about the Genesis and if it had any accessories or anything, but, yeah, um, so PGA Tour Golf, the next game is the most iconic, uh, Genesis game ever, I think. And that would be Sonic the Hedgehog. It's not for resale value one, so that means that came in a bundle with that. But, like the others, has the manual. Another great condition cart. Happy. Nice manual. A little bit, they're all a little bit bent on the inside, but that's only the case. So, Sonic the Hedgehog. That's another one to my library. And then the third game, yeah, respect my third tire. Hmm. Alright, so the third game is the best condition one, um, and that is Soldiers of Fortune. You see, you got the little hang tag still on there, it hasn't been broken off yet, uh, which is really nice, you know, really good stuff. And, uh, it's a really good condition box. What I love about this one is, besides the fact that it's in great shape, manuals in great shape, still got the registration card, is that the fact that it has the the original and Soldiers of War poster, or Soldiers of Fortune poster, I mean, um, I'm going to do this one here. I'm not going to fold it all the way because I'll have to, you know, I will if I have to. Alright, there we go. 
All right, there it is. So this is Fortune. This, this is one side of it. This is all the characters with their stats. Um, let's, let's see the brigand, the navi or navy. I don't know. The gentleman, the scientist, the mercenary, and the thug. And soldiers of fortune. And then the other side, it's the box art for it. So, scientist. But yeah, it's pretty cool. And I'm happy that it has all this. So awesome, retro 90s. But um, yeah. So that's that's it, guys. See ya.